Hey everybody, we're going to be winding a grandfather clock in this video. This is my Sly Triple Chime grandfather clock. And as you can see, the weights are getting close to the bottom of the clock, so we need to wind it. So the key to wind this clock, it comes with a crank, so you would insert this into the keyhole and then you would twist it. So we're going to do that. We're going to open up the top access door. And then we're going to take the key, put it in. And you just twist it counterclockwise and the weight goes up. And then it will stop when it gets up to the top. See, I can no longer twist it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on a tripod and I'll let you guys see uh, for one of the weights me winding it here and then I'll let you guys see the weight go up. So let's cue that footage. All right, we're going to wind up the middle weight, so I'm going to put the key in, and here we go. And there's the metal weight. One more weight needs to be wound, so we're going to wind the right side, because that's the last one we need to wind. And you guys can see, it will not turn anymore. The clock has been wound up all the way. So we can close this door and you guys can hear one of my other clocks going off. So we'll close that and then that will be it for this video. That was winding the Sly Triple Chime Grandfather Clock. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.